Well, a community at the Jersey Shore is on alert tonight after several mysterious bags filled with disturbing flyers started showing up on their lawns. Some neighbors say they feel threatened by the messages on the pamphlets. Action reporter Becca Hendrickson has that story tonight from Brigantine. Police say the bags were tossed around the island onto people's lawns between Saturday night and Sunday morning. Investigators say the flyers didn't contain any threats, but the Jewish community here in Brigantine does feel threatened. It's reminiscent of in Germany before all the Jews were rounded up in the Holocaust. And it's, it makes us feel very vulnerable. As hundreds of bags like this popped up on porches and lawns around Brigantine Sunday morning, Jan Sarator, who is president of Temple Beth Shalom in Brigantine, started to feel unsafe in her own home. When you live in a small community like Brigantine, you don't expect this to happen. And here we are in Brigantine, and for whatever reason, we were marked. The bags contain anti-Semitic propaganda, which the city has been quick to denounce. Police are investigating this as a bias incident. Let's make no mistake about this. This is unadulterated anti-Semitism and, and must be condemned. The Anti-Defamation League says white supremacist propaganda continues to rise. There have already been more than 150 instances of it in Philadelphia, Delaware, and South Jersey so far in 2022. And officials say neighbors need to report it, not post it. It's very important that we are not reposting um, on social media the pictures of the flyers and those pieces because it gives them uh, part of what they're looking for. After an event like this, you, you don't feel safe. As police investigate, Jewish leaders in Brigantine say they're anxious to learn who is responsible. We don't know right now whether this was somebody local distributing this material or somebody who came in from out of town. We'd like to know. Police are hoping home surveillance video will help solve this case. They're asking anyone who has cameras in the areas where the flyers were found to give them a call. In Brigantine, Becca Hendrickson, Channel 6, Action News.